Hello there, and welcome to Pets Aplenty. Today on the channel, you'll learn about the Norwich Terrier, a very energetic breed that enjoys the company of humans. As always, we've gathered all this information to help you make an informed decision if you're drawn to this beautiful dog. Before we continue, though, we would love for you to become a member of the channel by clicking on the Join button down below. You can also review the perks of Pets Aplenty membership after clicking the Join button. Now, let's get into the video. The Breed's History the Norwich Terrier is a hybrid of Little Irish Terriers and other short-legged terrier breeds. They were developed to assist in reducing the rodent population in Britain. As a result of selective breeding, these dogs are friendlier and more social than the typical terrier, so they could be utilized in packs during fox hunts. Although it is one of the tinier working terriers, Norwich's stocky build and resilience were used when tracking the game through narrow tunnels. These dogs, formerly known as Cantab Terriers, have shown their worth on the hunt in the stable yard and as energetic and entertaining household pets. Cambridge University and the Norwich Terrier have a long-standing, well-known connection. Owning one of these canine species became a trend among college students in the 1870s and 1880s. In the United States, the breed's history may be traced back to 1914 when a British man called Frank Rough Rider Jones used Rags offspring to create a dog they named Willem. Willem was sent across the ocean to Philadelphia, where he established himself as a leading stud for his breed in the United States. Due to the strong association between Rough Rider Jones and these happy prick-eared terriers, the breed is commonly referred to as the Jones Terrier in the United States. Before the English Kennel Club established a breed standard in 1923, there needed to be more consistency within the breed. Because of their close genetic relationship, the American Kennel Club did not officially designate Norwich and Norfolk Terriers as distinct breeds until 1979. Appearance the Norwich Terrier is one of the tiniest terrier breeds, standing at 10 inches at the shoulders and weighing around 12 pounds for both males and females. Even though they are small, Norwiches are not soft lap dogs. They were initially developed to be courageous ratters. Their upright, pointed ears set them apart from their canine counterpart, the Norfolk Terrier. The Norwich Terrier has a double coat, a soft, downy, insulating undercoat, and a hard, wiry, straight outside coat. A protecting mane of their hair grows around its neck and shoulders. Underneath the minimal arch of the brow, tiny black eyes sparkle. He has short hair everywhere else, including his ears and muzzle. Any shade of red, a combination of black or red hairs with white hairs, light yellow or fawn or black and tan, is acceptable for the Norwich coat. Temperament the Norwich is a very energetic dog that enjoys the company of humans. This playful breed is perfect for any family because of its fearlessness and sassy personality. He is kind and gets along well with children and other animals. Norwich Terriers are known for being independent thinkers, but they also take great pleasure in satisfying their human companions. He needs human interaction and will quickly become an integral part of your family. With plenty of care from its master or family, it, in return, will be devoted to them for years to come. Because of his high intellect and heightened awareness, he will definitely raise the alarm if he detects any strange activity in the neighborhood. Socialization Norwich Terriers, like other dogs, benefit significantly from early socialization or exposure to various people, environments, and stimuli. You can achieve this by introducing him to dog-friendly establishments and taking him on long walks around the neighborhood. Norwich Terriers are dog-friendly, getting along well with every other breed we've tested. They can acclimate to sharing a home with cats, but only if they're introduced to them early enough. The Norwich Terrier breed is well known for its adoration of all people. They thrive in families where children are present. An adult Norwich might perform best in a household with children old enough to engage with him appropriately. However, without adult supervision, you should never leave a dog with a child to avoid any potential for biting or ear or tail tugging on either side. Instruct your kid to never mess with a dog's meal or attempt to steal from him. Your Norwich Terrier puppy will develop into a balanced adult dog with proper socialization. Put him in the best possible position to succeed by enrolling him in puppy kindergarten. Grooming 
The Norwich Terrier has a waterproof outer coat and a warm, fluffy undercoat that sheds. Maintaining a spotless Norwich only requires regular brushing once a week. The breed only requires frequent showers if he messes up by playing outside. Hand stripping removes the outer layer of hair and the undercoat, allowing new hair to come through. It also maintains its luster and deep hues with careful maintenance. Your Norwich will most likely have a disheveled appearance and lose more hair if you don't strip him. So do this twice yearly, either by by hand or using a stripping tool to remove the dead top coat. Nail and teeth care are two more aspects of personal grooming. The Norwich must have their teeth brushed at least twice a week to prevent tartar accumulation and the germs it harbors. If your dog doesn't wear down its nails naturally, you should trim them periodically. Make grooming a fun and rewarding experience now. Check for symptoms of infection such as redness, soreness, or inflammation on the skin, in the ears, nose, mouth, and eyes, and on the feet while you groom. You'll be able to examine yourself thoroughly and catch any developing health issues before they become serious. Start socializing him to being handled by brushing and examining him while your Norwich is still a puppy. Dogs are pretty sensitive to touching their feet, so be sure to do this often. He'll be more amenable to veterinarian checkups and other forms of handling as an adult. A consistent grooming routine is necessary for this breed, so it's essential to give it careful thought before choosing this breed. You can learn how to get it done yourself or locate a professional groomer who will do it for a fee. Exercise Norwich Terriers have a high prey drive due to their vivacious nature and keen sense of hunting instincts. They are active and curious and should be in good shape for the day. For the sake of their emotional and physical well-being, they need to exercise regularly. They are great walking partners and a couple of brisk 10-15 to 15 minute walks per day or fenced in playing can satisfy their daily activity needs. They also need plenty of time to run about in a secure yard and all walks should be taken on a leash since they can't help but satisfy their natural need to chase tiny animals. They are vivacious enough to play fetch all day, yet loving enough to spend hours curled up on the lap of their favorite human. With their high energy and enthusiasm, Norwich Terriers generally learn quickly and adapt well to new environments. Despite his reputation for noise, the Norwich Terrier is apartment-friendly so long as his mental and physical demands are addressed. Training Norwich Terriers are lively, tiny dogs typically trainable because they want to please. Puppies need to be trained appropriately to mature into the friendly, outgoing dogs typical of the breed. The most significant results from training sessions with this intelligent but occasionally willful breed have been found with brief, upbeat sessions. As long as you set clear boundaries and teach consistently, this breed may be relatively straightforward to train. Avoid making training sessions too routine to help your Norwich develop interest. Crate training, a humane method of preventing your Norwich from having accidents or getting into things he shouldn't is essential. Diet and Nutrition the Norwich Terrier thrives on either commercially produced or homemade high-quality dog food. Your adult dog's calorie needs will vary according to age, size, metabolism, and degree of exercise. As expected, a hyperactive dog will need more than a less active dog. Half a cup to one cup of premium dry food daily, split between two meals, is ideal. Discover what kinds of human foods can be fed to your dog and what can't, and provide clean water at all times. Keep an eye on your dog's calorie intake and weight, since certain and canines are predisposed to becoming overweight. While treats may be a great tool in training, too many can lead to weight gain and even obesity. See your veterinarian if you have any challenges or questions about your dog's diet. Health Norwich Terriers, in general, are a very healthy breed. Breeders that care about their animals' well-being conduct tests for diseases including hip dysplasia, epilepsy, and degenerative myelopathy, as well as for upper airway syndrome, a respiratory disorder whose frequency and mechanism of inheritance are unknown but which is screened for by responsible breeders. Find a reliable breeder willing to provide you with health documentation for both parents before you commit to purchasing a puppy from them. A dog with a current health clearance has been tested for and found to be free of a specific disease or illness. How often do you take your dog for a vet visit? Let us know in the comments section below. Consider becoming a member of our channel by clicking the join button to get early access to our upcoming videos plus other membership perks. Also, check out our playlists and click on the video links that pop up at the end of this video. Thank you for watching.